What's up, YouTube family? Welcome back or welcome to Lin Lin. Thank you guys so much for coming to check out the video today. Guys, I am headed into my local grocery outlet. Now, grocery outlet is just a small little store. I know it's here in Oregon. There's quite a few of them here in Oregon. I wanna say they're in a couple other states as well, but it's not a big, big place like, you know, Fred Myers or Winco or places like that. So um, I'm heading in here today just to see what I can find. I haven't been in here for a long time. Um, usually I can find a deal on some stuff. Now I don't buy like meat or anything like that from here, but I know they have it um, on discount or, you know, they have it for cheaper prices sometimes than they have in the regular stores. But I'm pretty much just heading in here to see what I can find because there's all kinds of things that I usually see in here that you won't see in other stores. I found things like different chips that you won't see in regular stores. There's like um, things like cereals you won't see in regular stores. So I kind of just want to go in here and see what I can find. All right, guys, let's go and see what we can get up in here. Their baskets are always lined up outside, but luckily they're under the shelter so they do not get wet. First off, they have a couple fruits right here, but these are a little bit on the expensive side. The strawberries are $4.99. The blueberries are $4.99. Grapes are $5.99. They have these pancake cereal things in here. Have you guys ever tried these? I haven't tried them, but my kids been asking me for them. I might get them, but those are $4.99 in here, so I'll think about it. They got the chicken breast in here for $1.99 a pound. So these are the boneless, skinless chicken breasts. So these are like $10. That one's $8. They got some seasoned pork ribs and St. Louis pork spare ribs in here for $3.49 a pound. Let's see, they have some plank fish in here. This is some um, Atlantic salmon on a cedar plank. Those are $9.99 in here. Their fish doesn't look that great to me. I don't know. These are <clears throat> this is steelhead fish fillets. Those are seven dollars. Some are eight dollars. I've never had steelhead fish, so I'm gonna pass on those. But they have those in here. So walking in, they have the cuties in here for two ninety nine, and I want to say I paid three ninety nine or four ninety nine for them at Winco the other day. This is a two pound bag. These are the cuties. The other ones were the mandarins. I think I'm gonna grab a bag of these today since these are only $2.99. My kids have already gone through the other ones that I bought a couple days ago, so I'm gonna grab one of these. They have these cookies right here. These are two for five. I don't know if you guys remember these cookies, but I used to always buy these frosted cookies right here. These are in here for two for five. I think I'm gonna come back over here and grab a celery. The celery in here is 99 cents for one big stock like this of celery. So I'm gonna grab a celery. I'll find some use for it because 99 cents is not bad. I wanna say it's like $2 and some change um, at the other stores at Winko and Fred Meyer. So I'm gonna grab that. Now they have a lot of what they call NOSH in here, which is natural, organic, specialty, and healthy items. So like all of these deodorants right here are aluminum free. I use aluminum free deodorants. These ones are five, $5 in here, $4.99, elsewhere $7.99. I already have some, so I don't need any right now, but this is a good deal for these deodorants. These ones right here, the Schmitz products are $6.99 a piece. They also have black soap, um, cast oil soap, goat's milk soap. They got some activated charcoal here. Now this deal is good for the toothpaste. I do use um, fluoride free toothpaste. It is $5.99 in here for the Bronner's, Dr. Bronner's and for the Tom's is $6.99. That is definitely a good deal because like it says elsewhere, they are $8.49, $10, something like that. So I don't need any of that today, but now I know where to come to um, look for them next time. 
These are just some shower gels and some shampoos, body washes. They got Shea Moisture products in here. I just bought a bunch of that um, recently, so I don't need any of that. But that's a good deal for that in here, $4.99. You can also get those like at Burlington for $4.99 as well. So my main thing I wanted to come in here and do is just kind of look around. I did see the weekly newsletter and seen a couple things that I wanted to grab um, that are in the aisles. So I'm gonna grab those, but I wanted to see kind of what they had. They have the Hemp's Lotion. If you guys have ever smelled this lotion, these are really good. These, these smell really good. They're good at keeping you moisturized, but they are expensive. So these little bottles right here is $10.99. Elsewhere about $15. So it varies with price. I've seen some for like $20 for a little bit bigger, um, but it does smell really good. This is, what is this? Is this lotion? Yeah, this is a body moisturizer. So this is a lotion too. And these ones are $12.99 as you can see. So there's 60 count eggs in here. It's pretty much the same at Winko, $19.29 for their 60 count. Their regular accounts are between $6.49, $4.99 for the organic ones, $3.99 for those ones. So those prices are pretty much the same, but I don't need eggs because I just bought a 60 count of eggs when I went to Winko the other day. So we are good on eggs. Just looking down the um, soup and baking aisle just to kind of see what they have. I like looking at what they have. They got some jasmine rice in here for $5.99. That's a little bit of a better price than it is um, at Walmart where I bought it. They got some truff hot sauce in here, black truffle infused hot sauce, $4.99. I've never tried that. I've heard of it, but um, I don't know if I want to try it actually. I heard that it's pretty hot, but it's $4.99 in here. Elsewhere is $6.99. They got a big bottle of this brand of Sriracha. I've never heard of this one, but this is $3.99. It's saying elsewhere $5.99. I've never seen this brand though. I don't know, when it comes to Sriracha, I stick to the original one because, I don't know, I guess the other ones seem like knockoffs to me. It's probably not, it probably all tastes the same, but you know, I don't know. You stick with what you know, right? So they have these noodles in here. I love buying these noodles. The only thing is when I get them, Everyone seems to eat them up really quick. But these noodles are good. I usually will get those and put like sausage, shrimp, eggs, all that kind of stuff in it. They're only $4.69 here. Elsewhere they are $11.49. So you know what, actually I think I might grab one today. This comes with four in a bag. So basically you're paying a dollar and some change per pack of noodles. So I'm gonna grab these today because that is a good deal for those. So they have this 100% pure maple syrup in here. And this is only $6.99, elsewhere is $11.99. I'm gonna grab this today because I do pay between pretty much eight to $10 for this kind of syrup, the 100% maple syrup. So because it is only $6.99 in here today, I'm gonna grab one of those because that is a good deal for that. They have a bunch of little snacks. Most of these I've never heard of or I've never seen them before. Like they have these red hot snack rolls with ranch and bacon flavor. Those are only $3.99. They also have some White Castle burgers in here for $11.99. They have some um, samosas is um, I think how you pronounce it. They got some chicken ones. They have some vegetable ones as well. They have some pizza rolls and things like that in here. And the prices aren't bad actually because you are paying way more. I think I passed on these the last time I seen them because um, they were way more in the store. These right here, these are little pizza snacks. These are only $2.99. I think I'm gonna grab these because these are a good snack for the kids when they come home from school. They got taquitos in here, but their taquitos are pretty much the same price in here. It's saying elsewhere 1049, but I don't know where else they're that much because 
I want to say I only paid like seven dollars or maybe eight dollars for a Matt Winko. I don't know but I think I will grab one of them today because my kids went through these pretty quick and they like these so I'm gonna get these for them today as well now they have all kinds of little crazy drinks in here some of these I've never even heard of they have a bunch of different drinks um, they got the Izzy's they got monster drinks they got carbonated uh, Ramoon drink um, that's an Asian drink they got the Jones cane sugar um, orange chocolate soda that actually sounds good those are only 99 cents um, they got what is this ginger beer these are five dollars and 29 cents they got a bunch of the hints now I've tried the hints before I don't really care for them um, I'd rather just stick to my lemon water actually but they're not bad um, but yeah I, I'd rather just stick to the lemon water they got these, I remember I used to always, I used to always, always drink these little flavored waters back in the day. These are $1.99 for a six pack of them. Um, they have the lemon ones and they have the acai grape ones. $1.99, that's not bad for those. They've got some cinnamon toast crunch cinnamon milk hot chocolate. I had to think about that for a minute. That sounds like that is just so sweet. Those are only $1.99, and this is a big pack of them, too. There's six envelopes. Oh, so there's 12. There's six, um, or there's there's only six. There's six mixes, and then there's six with the marshmallows and the cinnamon dust in them. That sounds like sweet on top of sweet right there. But those are only $1.99. Now, I just bought hash browns the other day, and I paid about $4 and some change, almost $5 for them, and look they have this whole thing 20 patties right here for four dollars and 49 cents that's a really good deal I still have a lot of the ones that I have in there so I'm not gonna get those but that's a really good deal for those 20 of them for 450 that's a good deal they got some rice cauliflower in here this is 399 now at one point in time I was trying rice cauliflower I actually really like it my family did not like it. They told me to stop making it. No one really ate it. So I would just buy little bags of it like this and make it for myself because they didn't really care for it. But do you guys like rice cauliflower? If you do, comment down below if you like it or if you've even tried it before. So they have these little things down here reduced for $3.98 a bag. These are Cracker Barrel cheeses. Now, I'm usually really big on cheese, but I told myself this year that I was going to cut back on just eating cheese because that's what I'll do. I'll buy cheese like that and just eat it like straight from the package or slice it, put some crackers with it, things like that. But I told myself I was going to stop doing that this year and cut back on all the cheese intake. But that's a good deal for those, though. Three for 98 cents. So they have this brown sugar ham in here for a dollar and 49 cents. That is an excellent deal because elsewhere it's either 4.99 or you might be paying more. I don't even know, but I don't eat ham or else I would grab this, but that is an extremely good deal for only a dollar 49. I'm trying to see if they have any other meat for a good deal, but I don't know. Well, they do got some oven roasted turkey breast right here for 3.99. That's actually a good deal for this one as well because um, I want to say the smaller one that I paid for at Winko was around the same price and it was way less than this and of course it's gone already. So I think I'm going to grab this $3.99 for a one pound um, size of honey roasted turkey breast. They also have these little cracker barrel things right here. Now this is exactly what I was talking about. Like I will get these things like this with the cheese and the crackers and the pepperoni and this is what I would eat. But you know what, I think I might grab one of these because it's not just the cheese. You know, you get the whole little thing with this. So I'm going to grab a couple of these because these are only 99 cents. Elsewhere it says that they are $2.49. So I'm going to grab a couple of these. These are good for a snack when I'm at work or something like that. So I'm going to grab a couple of those and then we're going to head back down the aisle. So I actually just bought some of these last night at Walmart and paid $8 and some change for them and they're $6.99 here. 
maybe they're $13.99 at like Safeway or something, but they're $6.99 here. But since I just got some, I know where to come back to if I want to get them again. It definitely won't be Walmart. I'll be coming back here to get them. These are really, really good too. If you haven't tried them, try them. Jumbo coconut shrimp, really, really good. Pop them in the air fryer and they're good to go. They also have these shrimp fried rice bites. That sounds different. So it's filled with shrimp and rice and some yum yum sauce. These are $3.99. That's not a bad deal. I don't think I'm gonna try those today though, but I might come back and get those, but that sounds good. It does sound good. They have a few um, seafood things in here. They got the buffalo bites, they got chicken wings, boneless chicken wings, chicken patties. Um, I'm not big on eating the chicken patties and things like that. I used to buy them, but I kind of just stopped. My kids really didn't eat them, and they ended up just like sitting there or getting freezer burnt or something like that. So I kind of just stopped buying them. But they do have a lot of stuff like that. They got turkey burgers, Angus burgers. They got some sausage patties here. This was one of the things that I seen. But these are full pork patties. I don't want the pork patties, but those are only $3.99. That's not bad. I want to say they're like five dollars and some change in um winko for those they got some uncrustables i used to love uncrustables but these things are super expensive and i'm like at this point you can make your own sandwich and cut the crust off because for 10 of these is 8.49 for four of them is 3.59 so those will be sitting right there today they also have the croissants. Now, I really, really like these two. The last time I got them, though, I got them from um, Costco. And I think they were a little bit more um, expensive, but you got more in the package. I'm going to go to Costco one of these days. I haven't been lately because the Costco out here, really, it'd be so packed and overwhelming that it'd just be not a good experience in there. you just be wanting to get in and get out because it'd just be that packed. So they got these little Jimmy Dean toaster up things. These are only $2.99. These are ham, egg, and cheese. I think I might grab these and have um, you know my kids try them. It says these are new. These would be a good snack in the morning for my teenagers who don't really eat in the morning but complain about being hungry. So that's a good thing that they can just pop in the toaster real quick. For $2.99, you can't beat that. One thing about in here, you will see cereals and stuff that you do not see in the regular stores. Like, I've never seen this Spider-Man cereal. That's only $1.99. They also have the Sugar Cookie Toast Crunch. I've seen that. I've never seen the chocolate one. Those are both $1.99 in here. They got some Monster High cereal for $1.99. They got the Miraculous. So these are all shows that are like on Netflix and things like that. They have cereals for them. They got the Charlie Brown cereal for $2.99. They got some Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle cereal. These are $1.99. My kids would flip on this, but I'm not gonna get them because I don't really give them too much cereal. But um, that's cute though, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, this is from the movie, the Mutant Mayhem movie. So those came out when the movie came out, I'm guessing. But they got that in here for $1.99. They got Pop-Tarts in here, $2.99. That's a really good deal for those for the 16-pack. The 8-packs are $1.99. They got a Boston Cream Donut. Do you guys like Boston Cream Donuts? My favorite ones are the S'mores. Those have been my favorite for as long as I've been eating Pop-Tarts. I really, really love those ones. I always get that one. And my kids are always like, why do you always get that one? It's my favorite. They got a Apple Jacks Pop-Tart. Oh my gosh, that just seems so sweet. $1.99 though. They also have a frosted banana bread. That sounds good. The Eagle ones I've seen before, but I've never seen the frosted banana bread. Those look good. Those look really good, but I don't know, a little bit too sweet. You guys like Pop-Tarts or are they just too sweet? Um, but like I said, I do enjoy the s'mores ones. But you know what? I think I might try these ones. I think I'm gonna grab these and just let the kids try them because for $1.99, you can't beat that. And I love banana bread. So I might try it and see what it tastes like. But they have a bunch of plant-based proteins in here. I'm actually looking for a protein. I'm starting to get back into my workout routines 
and I've been looking for a protein that I can use to, you know, build muscle and all that. I haven't come across one that I want yet, but I think I might come back in here and check them out. Have my husband come with me because he's more into all this as far as like knowing what to get and what not to get. So they do have a really good selection of it. They also have a bunch of um, greens in here. They have a bunch of things like the maca powder, the maca root powder. This is really good. I've um, done maca root powder pills before. They have some moringa, reishi mushroom. They have hemp seeds. They have just about every plant-based protein or cocoa powder. They got some tiramic powder. This is really good. I um, made a lot of my juices with turmeric. Um, they got beet powder. They have a bunch of different little powders. They got chia seeds, flax seeds, and these are all reasonably priced. Um, they're all between like that's $4.99, $7.99, $12.99. You got some for nine, six dollars. So they have a pretty good selection in here. And I didn't know all this was in here because usually I don't come over to this side. I just stick to the grocery side. But I'm glad I came over here and seen this. I'm definitely going to come back up here and try to figure out what kind of stuff I should get. This is just some of their um, healthy food aisle products that they have over here. Organic, um, things like that. This is just a couple of the things they have over here. They have a big beer selection and all that. I'm not a beer drinker, so keep it moving. They got all your Cliff Bars, Protein Bars, Kind Bars, all these. And these are all reasonably priced, $3.99, $2.99. And this is for bars with six in a pack and things like that. So this is all just pretty much the healthy foods aisle. These things right here look really good. Walnut cranberry bites. Now I've seen something like that. Actually, I used to buy something like that in Costco. I need to go back to Costco and see if I can find those. Those are really, really good. Um, they're clusters like that, but I can't remember what's in them, but they're similar to those. They got the Magic Spoon cereals. My kids actually enjoyed the Magic Spoon cereals that I got from the food bank. They really liked it. I thought they wouldn't like it because of, you know, um, it has like spirulina and things like that in it, but they actually enjoyed it. They, it, it's not sweet. It wasn't sweet at all, but they didn't mind it. They actually ate both boxes of it and yeah, was wondering if they could get some more. These are only $4.99 in here and they're elsewhere $9.99. And I have seen that price, I wanna say at Walmart for these. But they only have the maple waffle flavor in here for those. You guys ever tried these cookie pop chips now i remember when they first came out i can't remember what kind i had but we did try those i didn't really like them i mean they're just candy coated popcorn but right now they got these ones in here for 199 have you guys ever tried those leave a comment down below if you have they have a bunch of little chips in here and they range between 199 299 they got some barbecue takis called chips never heard of those those are 199 it says these are new i've never seen those i like coming here because the, you will see things that you have never seen in other stores you will never see in other stores and you just be surprised about the stuff that you see because you'd be like i've never seen that I've never heard of it so i like coming in here for that because they have a variety of just crazy foods that you won't see in other stores they got some of the Tim's brand chips in here. These are $3.99 elsewhere. $3.19 in here. If you guys have heard of the pink sauce, they actually have this in here for $2.99. Elsewhere $9.99? I don't know, because I've actually seen it in the dollar store as well. But her product is selling in a lot of stores. Good for her. Yeah, I've never tried it. I don't even know if I want to try it, but... I mean, $2.99, you can't beat that. They got a couple little snacks here. So their snacks are, hmm, I guess some of them are good price, some of them aren't. They have a couple things in here, not too many. Not too many snacks. I guess I don't need any snacks, really. But they have a couple things in here. They got 
Well, this isn't a bad deal for the um, fruit snacks. $3.99, elsewhere $5.99. That's right, they're about that much. But I don't buy these ones because these ones have corn syrup in them. There's another brand that I buy that is better, um, that does not have, well, I won't say it's better, but it does not have corn syrup in it. It's not in here. I want to say I probably bought it at Costco, but they do have those in here. Check this out. They have Cinnabon pudding. That sounds gross. <laughs> Would you guys try this? Cinnabon pudding? Now, I like Cinnabons just as much as the next person, but in a pudding, I don't know. But those are $1.49 in here. So I'm gonna check out their produce section. They don't have a big produce section. I already grabbed some of the oranges. I mean, cause their pineapples and stuff are a little bit more than they are in the regular store. Their lemons are a dollar. You guys know I get mine from Winko and they're only, um, what, 33 cents, 28 cents, something like that. I did grab a bag of the cuties just because those are more expensive other places and $2.99 is a good deal for those. But as far as other fruits, I don't see too much of anything that I want to buy in here. They have a good selection, but like I said, theirs is a little bit more on the expensive side. Their ground beef is pretty much the same, $10.99, $13.99. Um, their chicken, like I said, is $1.99 a pound for the boneless, skinless chicken breast. They got some carne asada in here. They got um, a few little things. But I don't know if their prices are pretty much the same as the other stores. They got chopped kale in here for $3.99. I really like kale. Do you guys like kale? I got a really good kale and potato recipe that I make and, and I love it. I love it. Kale, potatoes, sausage. Can't go wrong with that. So I do enjoy kale. But I have my cabbage that I need to cook so I'm not going to buy any kale today. They got a few things over here. These are marked down a dollar off for the spring mix of salad produced for quick sale. They just have, this is the organic section. So they have a few things in here, but I did my haul on all my fruits and vegetables um, and I still have a bunch of vegetables. Fruits I need to go re-up on, but vegetables I'm good on. So I guess this is their little clearance rack right here. They got this Rice Krispie cereal for $1.98, that one $1.78. They got these My Muse antioxidant um, drinks right here. These are 78 cents. Got some extreme heat. Extreme Heat Pickle Chips, $1.98. A couple Slim Jims for three, four dollar. I think I'm gonna grab a couple of these, three, four dollar. You can't beat that because elsewhere you are paying $1.99 for one. Grab a couple of these. Tartar Sauce is 98 cents. I think I'm gonna grab one of these as well because elsewhere it's saying $3.49. Can't go wrong with Tartar Sauce for only 98 cents. They have these Lara bars. These are pumpkin spice Lara bars for $1.98. And there are 16 bars. Oh, this one's 16, this one's six. This one's $1.98, this one's $3.98. They have those down there as well. They got an advent calendar for pets, I think that is, $1.98. And then just the cereal for $1.48. Okay, so I got a couple things in here. They got a couple things that I um, grabbed. So I am satisfied with those couple things. Now I'm going to head to the register and see what this comes up to. The little clearance aisle is cute. I mean, they had a couple things in their clearance, but not too many. But this is what I got. I got toaster ups. Got some more taquitos. Gonna try the banana bread pop tarts. Got some more sandwich meat. The tartar sauce, only 99 cents. Got the um, oranges down there. So now I'm gonna head to the register and I'm gonna see what this comes up to, guys.
I'm good. How are you? I have a bag right here. Okay. Okay guys, I am back in the car and I have just finished shopping in grocery outlet. So I'm gonna tell you guys how much I spent. I spent a total of $38.88 and I got, let me see, I got a few things. It doesn't show me exactly how many items I purchased, but $38.88. $38.88, that wasn't bad for the few things that I got. As you guys can see, I got like banana Pop-Tarts, um, banana bread Pop-Tarts. I got some little toaster strudel type things for my kids for breakfast. I got a few things that I basically wouldn't see in other stores or basically that I would be paying a little bit more for in other stores, like the 100% maple syrup. I know for sure is more in other stores because I buy it all the time and it is definitely a little bit more expensive. So I actually had a good shopping experience in there today. I didn't get a bunch of stuff. I didn't get too much fruit, but I did get some cuties that were on sale in there for $2.99, which is, which is an excellent deal because they are $4.99 in other stores, if you can even find them in other stores right now. All right, guys, so that is the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff, and I will see you guys next time. All right, bye.